Hi everyone. Today we want to talk about the scalping signals in the VIP channel and everything you guys need to do to get the best out of it. The first thing you need to know is that for scalp trading, you need to be very organized. In other words, it would be much better if you have one PC with two monitors or have your Telegram app on one device and your trading platform on another device. We post our scalp signals during the London and New York session. Why? Well, it's due to the high volume in the market, low spreads, and more liquidity during those sessions. However, there are also good opportunities in the Sydney and Tokyo sessions, but due to the low volume in the market and high spreads, we do not post any scalp signals at that time. There are also zero spread trading accounts in which brokers have zero spread for those who are not happy to pay their spread, but the brokers will get their commissions in other forms anyways. So have your trading platform open on your computer and also do not forget to turn on the notifications on your Telegram app. Guys, I want to remind you again that for the scalp signals, you need to be organized and quick. Okay, the next thing is your trading setup. As you see here, we post our scalp signals by hashtag scalping in the VIP channel. In the signals, you can see the name of the chart, direction of the trade, the entry price, stop loss, and also take profits. Now it's time to set up our trade. Based on your money management, you set the TPN stop loss, and finally execute the trade. After that, you need to wait for the result, or in some cases, wait for the updates. Here in this example, I want to tell you how to modify your open trades. In the signal, after we opened the trade, the price reached a daily support and there was a potential that the price could reverse and hit our stop loss. So our team decided to update the signal and by moving the stop loss to the entry point, we made the trade risk free. If there was a confusion, do not trade the signals until you make sure that you understood the concept correctly. Let us know if you had any questions. We will always come back with a better explanation. Asking is much better than making a mistake.